Today, Walden watched as her attacker pleaded guilty, giving her and her family a sense of closure and the courage to speak out against abuse. I'm not going to look back. I'm just going to move forward from this. A year and a half after she was brutally assaulted, Crystal Walden is finding closure as her attacker pleaded guilty. And at this time, you do plead guilty to two counts of assault in the second degree. Yes. Eric Torres took a plea deal after the March 2013 assault. The original charges of first-degree sexual abuse, rape, and kidnapping all dropped for two second-degree assault charges. Now Torres faces a minimum of 90 months in prison. Enough for Walden, who says that she's satisfied with Thursday's outcome. Just, I'm glad it's over. It's been a long time coming. Um, I'm glad justice is served. A long process. He's been through three different attorneys, and now after a year and a half, finally we do have some closure for the victim in this case. A victim, a survivor, bravely willing to address the attack, not only in court, but in public, while urging other women to do the same. I'm a survivor of a brutal, brutal attack, and women out there that are going through this just get help and call, you know, just get help. Don't go back. Both Walden and the prosecutor did not want to go into specific details of the attack. Torres will be sentenced in November. He waived his right to a trial by jury. In the studio, Matt Jordan, NBC5 News.